Welcome back to Bottom Deck Achievements, a Hearthstone achievement hunting series. The Wailing Caverns miniset has been out now for about a week as I'm recording this, and uh, its effects have settled into the meta. Wild is completely broken with Stealer of Souls Warlock, and uh, in standard, Shaman is actually good now. Uh, looks like that Wailing Vapor card did the trick. But today, I want to look at two specific cards from the miniset to look at one of the new achievements and one of the older achievements from the base Baron set. Uh, the new achievement being the Priest one, uh, destroy a bunch of minions with a new Against All Odds spell, and the other being the Hunter, summon a bunch of hyenas in one turn to see if their new Frenzy minion can get the job done. Uh, but first, I have one achievement to claim, so let's do that. I know that I always plug my Twitch at the end of these videos. Uh, you can follow me at HeyTallman on Twitch if you want. Uh, but I actually streamed some Hearthstone the other day. Uh, I was playing a little Highlander Priest, uh, as well as some Murloc Shaman in Wild, uh, trying to see what I could do against these Warlock decks, and I managed to get this one with Priest. It involved me playing two Reno Jacksons, uh, one that I put in my deck and one that I seanced, as well as healing myself up a bunch and uh, pinging my own face with the Shadow Reaper Anduin hero power uh, in order to be at a low enough health total to heal the full 40 health. Uh, overall, it didn't take too many games of Highlander Priest to get this done. Uh, I think this is a lot easier to do in Wild with a Highlander list than trying to put all the heal stuff in your deck in Standard. Uh, so overall, not too bad of achievement. Um, and that's really all I have to say for my progress for stuff. I haven't been doing too much grinding for most of these. Uh, I was kind of waiting to see what I wanted to do for videos, kind of waiting for the meta to settle a little bit, and um, mostly just climbing in wild with Murloc Paladin, because that deck is good and fun still. All right, let's get to the decks. So my first deck... Hypothesis. Uh, this new card, Sindori Scentfinder, uh, will count towards the Summon a Bunch of Hyenas achievement that they put in, uh, that they wanted you to use Kolkar Packrunner. That's an epic. This is a common. Uh, I'm going to see if I can't proc two of these in the same turn to get that done. Uh, so I have two of these. I have a bunch of things that can you know, help me do this. I have Animated Broomstick to give it Rush, potentially. I have like Wound Prey. I have True Aim Crescent. And then just some stuff to draw me cards, some just decent stuff, and then just Mutanus because I like him. Prospector's Caravan because I still need that Caravan achievement. And uh, yeah, let's see how this does. Gotta do what I can. <laughs> Gotta start as many turns as I can with a Caravan to go for this achievement. <laughs> sure, fine, whatever. They were so scared of this. <laughs> They wasted so many resources to just get this out of the way. Alright, this is probably some kind of OTK thing. I grow impatient. I guess if there's multiple things on board, if I find both, I'll just need to get to turn 9 to Animated Broomstick after both Scent Finders. I'll just need enough stuff to trade in uh, both of the Scent Finders plus some of the Hyenas. So we'll see. Oh no! They hard ran glide in their deck? That just ruined me! What were they doing? I'm a hunter! I'm a hunter and I had cards in my hand! That's the most tragic thing. I'm now, I now have zero pieces of my combo. Uh, now I... Still need to find my other scent finder. Oh, this is bad. <laughs> Well, I might as well. I'm dead. I'm completely dead. I can't do the thing, but I might as well give them a couple ticks towards their achievement, right? Well, fuck. 
Oh hey, this counts as a hyena summoner too. How did I not realize that? Okay, this is gonna be like, well, I say it's gonna be easy to do, but look at how that game went. I can't believe Glide happened. That's tragic. Priest should at least give me the time to find all my pieces, hopefully. In store for you. Wow. That was a good play. Okay, there's my scent finder, which technically... I have to summon six in one turn, right? Technically, I think I can do that this turn, because Wound Prey summons the hyena as well, so... Careful. They fight. So if I ping my own guy. Now they're angry. It's four, five, six. Alright, cool. Got it. Well, I get to play this for the first time. No. Hey, I got something big. Let's go. Alex Draws is a pretty good, uh, pretty good get there. Yes, I'm dead. Well, we ate something big with Mutanis. Could have asked for that to be better. All right, we got our achievement at least. Here we go here. This one's finally done. Very easy with a new common card. Once I realized that Wound Prey also summoned a hyena, I realized I only needed one of the uh, scent finders. Uh, as long as I had two copies of Wound Prey. Uh, that was really easy. Oh, I was only one off from the first one of this one. Oh well. How close are we on the Scorpid one? four off. Okay, we'll get there real soon. Alright, let's move on to the priest deck. Hypothesis number two of the night is that the new card against all odds actually sucks and getting the achievement for killing at least ten minions with this spell is going to be difficult to do without like building a deck for you to specifically do that. Because uh, so, obviously you're going to need some stuff on your board as well. So that's what I did. I built the deck with Against All Odds with a couple of the zero-cost minions that are in standard. Uh, Desk, Imp, and Murloc Tinyfin for some cheap zero-cost stuff. Uh, Cleric of Anch helps uh, tutor for a spell. Wave of Apathy is a really good combo to set enemy minions attack to one. Therefore, they die to this card. Uh, then some other stuff I could find that just had odd... Uh, attack values to them. Wandmaker's just good in Priest. Uh, Caravan, because I still need that. Scorpid, because I need that. I might pop this one on this, uh, or at least the, the first level of the Hunter one. I'm only one off there. Uh, and then, of course, Best Boy Mutanis, because he's so lovable. Uh, Gahoon, I guess, draws me cards. <laughs> I guess. Uh, and then the old Samuro and Apotheosis combo. So let's hop in here, see if we can't kill 10 minions at once. Hopefully we find something that goes pretty wide, but not too wide that I just straight up die. Well, unfortunately, I don't think another priest is super going to get us there, but we'll see how this plays out. We come from far just to see you. All right, well... I think I gotta kill this caravan. Level one of that hunter achievement. Done. I still gotta play more watch post stuff too, so that's why they're in the deck. Could be good. Wave of Apathy now costing zero really helps. Cool. I mean, that's odd cost now as well. Uh, I just really need to find some of my, uh, some of my boys. 
It's almost a boy. This one's cheap and odd attack. The spell burst won't trigger as I play. I'll just have to remember to play Wave of Apathy first if I need to. I also have Rally to resurrect some stuff. We can get there. Looks good. That Fortitude is really cheap. Plus three attack can bring something even attack to be odd attack, if it needs to be. I might be able to get there next turn. Oh no, they're just swinging in. <gasps> they're gonna give me an achievement. Hey! <laughs> Oh, cool! And they all come back! Alright, this... I can do this this turn. I don't even need to play that many boys of my own. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six if I do this. Seven. Let me rally. No. I need to. F How much does. Against all odds, cost three, so that's three. Uh. Four, five. Six, seven. I think I can do it. Alright, so I got to fortitude first. Rally. All odd cost. Wave of apathy. Tiny fin. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Stand with me, friends. Such generosity. Get me out of here. Get me out of here. I did it. I did the thing. Okay, first try. Easy. So I kind of inadvertently uh, popped a bunch more achievements than I was expecting to in that one game. Uh, so let's crack a bunch of these. Level one of this one. Uh, ah, I'm almost halfway done. Uh, this one's going to be really easy. Scorpid's a good card. Um, just keep playing Scorpid in all your decks and you'll get there. Uh, speaking of Scorpid, finally did this one. Cool. And then, two levels of Even Steven. Okay. It always messes me up when the gold comes first before any experience goes pops off on screen. Uh, cool. Uh, Against All Odds is still a really weird card. Uh, I think with the other board clear options that Priest has access to, namely even just Samuro, um, Samuro Apotheosis with Zyrella, uh, I think there's plenty of stuff that you don't need to worry about running Against All Odds. Uh, however, the achievement can be done if you just build your deck uh, a certain way. Uh, glad I did. Glad it's over, though. Um, I'm going to delete this deck as soon as I uh, finish this video. Uh, speaking of finishing the video, uh, we have come to the end. I hope you found this video of some use. We didn't go super, super deep into any of the mechanics or anything, um, though I did think that that uh, against all odds turn was pretty complicated. Uh, pretty proud of that one. Uh, but if you like what you saw, please feel free to like the video and leave a subscription uh, to the channel if you'd like. And uh, if you have any hard-looking achievements that you'd like to see covered in a future video, please feel free to leave those in a comment below. And as always, if you want to be where I'm at, follow me on Twitter and Twitch. I'm at HeyTolman at both places. Uh, so with all that being said, uh, take easy, have a great day, and may the cards you need the most never be at the bottom of your deck.